Okay, of course, and as I told you in the presentation, our name is uh, Synergia, so we know that we only can make things if we work together. Uh, so I think it's really important inside the organization that you can that you find uh, the correct person for each place. No, that doesn't need to have uh, all the skills in the world, but needs to be a person that really like the job and uh, that are really motivated to make something. And I think if, if you have the correct person in each place, you can make great things. But if you are alone, you can make maybe, but it will be not so easy and probably the result will not, will not to be so great. So I, I think it's really important, I think in all the jobs, but more in, the, in this kind of organizations because you don't have a lot of money, you don't have a lot of um, support, you don't have a lot of tools, so you need to be creative and you need to use people. It's not use, but uh, you need to use the skills of each person in your team in order to, uh, to, uh, to reach all your goals. Teamwork is very important because a physician like us manage a very wide number of cases. So, being able to work over a single case with a relation of trust one by one, but being able to face many different cases. So, you have to be ready to work in team. By the way, uh, it's art because it's something that is not improvisation. And uh, we have some volunteers. We have a lot of volunteers, but it's not that easy for just for a person that first came to Porcoroso to be useful. It must be educated in a certain way. It must enter the idea of our job, that is an hierarchic job, but we don't have to improvisate. We have to be totally aware of what we are doing, it's a hard job because it's not easy even just to suggest the person what to do in this chaotic system that is our hosting system, our reception system, our system of deciding over the application for asylum. And so it's very important and it's very hard. Even because, for example, pardon, but uh, our team is uh, intercultural and uh, people of our, uh, our operators are from many different nationalities. So, for example, our meeting for the migration group, there's even the problem about what language to use. Because if we speak English, there's uh, a Ibu that speaks eight languages but not English. And so there's always a problem about translation. And this is a question, a problem, but we face it.